I think it's because there's still more War 3 Arena players that overcome the amount of hackers that are on Battle.net now. So you still probably got roughly about the same amount of people that are hacking. But because of the patch 1.29 update, you've got the War 3 Arena players, which are the legitimate really good players that don't need map pack, coming over and also playing. So they've basically increased the player base. So you probably still have as many hackers playing as there was before. It's just there's now more legit players from War 3 Arena also playing. I think that's my circumstance on the map pack situation as it currently stands. Can't they hack Witty account and then send it back to Witty for loads of money? Even if so if someone got my Gagoo account, I'd just say, okay, you can have it. I don't even care. Like, my Warcraft 3 accounts have never been particularly, um, sort of super special to me or anything like that. I haven't super hard tried to get any of the icons or whatnot. I, I mean, my favorite icon is the Naga icon, which is the 25 wins with random. That's my favourite. So all I would have to do is make a new account, get 25 wins uh, with random, and boom, I've got my account set up again. It's as simple as that. Come on then, give me the lumber. There we go. Thank you very much. I don't say bitch Naga, I say Naga C bitch. Because she is. She's sassy. Uh, I guess I'll put my shop over here. I'm still in a corner spot, so I should be relatively safe from pressure. What should I do then? You guys can tell me what it is I should do. Because I don't actually know what it is I'm doing right now. I'm just going with a standard build to start off with. Uh, apart from the Shadow Hunter. It's not exactly standard. Peon Rush. Alright, you got to give me something somewhat realistic. And Serpent Wards. High DPS indeed. Shaman plus HH. That's totally doable. I'm just low creeping at the moment because I want to get an expansion set up and then it'll be easier for me to do some silly things. How much range? 600 range. So they can hit as far as your hero can. That's good enough, isn't it? Let's see if we can do this. Those Serpent Wards almost feel like they're attacking quicker as well. Seems kind of awesome. some tankiness for our grunts. Let's go get some healing. Nice expansion set up. Next job is just to get the tech going. Probably one too many burrows. I do that quite regularly. We can be aggressive now. Or you can set up an expansion for green, but I'm already healing, so may as well use the time that I travel to go to an enemy base and heal up. Boop, boop. Hey, thank you very much there. Ho Ban Hamai. For the subscription with Twitch Prime. Thank you very much there. This guy looks like he might be in a Dynamut. He means your mum, doesn't it, in German? I want some experience, ideally, so let's kill any of the units, really, if we can. 
Doesn't look like he's finished his creek camp, so give me that creek camp. We can try. And try some pressure inside of an. You should never attack an undead base, but I reckon since there's two of us, and if I get enough serpent wards, I'll be okay. Hey, Nygaard, thank you very much there for the resub. Oh wow, is he teleporting to his base already from that position? Wow. Yeah, he's trying to get a better position on the serpent wards, but I don't know, man. Maybe that's worth it. Hey Gingerly, how is it going? Smiley face. Seems to be going alright, thank you very much there. She's got this around on the hero. Oh, we got three TPs. We should back now. And one of those TPs is some dude with militia as well. <laughs> so we should definitely get back now. Expansion's almost up. Almost level three. Expansion's up. How many fucking militia? Oh, there we go, level two. Is he trying to surround me? Stormbot, Stormbot, Stormbot. I'm actually in a good position because he can't do too much damage with, to me. So this is huge feed. So we want to get a headhunters, do we, and a shaman? Expansion's filled up. More than filled up now. So we forced some town portals there. They're doing a strong attack at the top there with two players, I think. So we know this is still probably vulnerable, so we can just go and come back to that area and try to get what we can get. So let's take a look and see how he's doing. Has he got towers up yet? No. In fact, he's got very little. Going to try to keep these serpent wards as close to the building as possible. So they can always be effective. I feel like I'm grinding harder than in World of Warcraft. Leveling up with some serious exper experience. He's focusing the wards though. Nah, not all of them though. He's gone back to the grunt, which is better for me. Seems to be going a little well. Let's try to split the wards up a bit more now. Oh, the bash proc! I was going to town portal just before that hit. 
<laughs> he gets a bash proc. Oh, I think the Serpent Wards have done pretty good so far. Calculated. That was completely calculated, that bash proc. He knew exactly what he was doing. Do I play StarCraft 2? Nah, I haven't played StarCraft 2 in ages. Okay, how are other people doing on the map? Orange clearing up what could be an expansion. Oh, it's a fast Great Hall. This guy's already got his expansion going. I've already had mine for quite some time. This guy's working on his. It's not got much gold there. And he's just gone over the 50 food mark, otherwise I would have given him some gold. Bears, dryads. Pushing back the undead imbalance. Hello there, Leon. What up? Word up. So we're going for the deeps. The DPS. Shadow Hunter. Now at 70%. Almost ready to unleash hell upon. Oh, Green's doing a 1 versus 2 right now. He looks fairly strong, to be honest. He could probably manage 1 versus 2 here. Especially with that extra bear coming in. Bears are so good if you're not fighting versus mass air, which is very possible in the uh, four versus four RT. Come on, Shadow Hunter, we're almost ready for you. I don't think he can come out. I think I'm going to go with another potion of mana. Loads of mana. Alright, I've got my little force. So let's trek across the map. This is a strat, but more of a troll. Get any units and heroes. No, Redman. No one likes it when I do stuff like that. You remember how hard people defend people that team kill me, but they won't give me even the light of day if I give a slight friendly tap to an enemy. Or an ally, sorry. I'm considering setting up. I can either come over here, but green might TP out. Nah, Teal's coming over here as well. Let the carnage begin. Anyone want to help this guy? Or is he doomed? Trying to get a frost now. Oh, so close to getting a kill. That'll be level five, and I can get level three serpent wards out. This isn't exactly the best force to use when sieging an enemy base. Oh, 
There we go. Got a shot coming, so I have some reinforcement of mana. Because this is firsty work, this is. That's 48 to 52 damage, average attack. You can't speed them up in any way, though, I don't think. Maybe they benefit from Endurance Aura. I'm not 100% sure about that. Oh, don't kill my shot. I want to get some mana. Oh. Kill my shot. I've got no mana. Pink trying to get revenge. He says D and D. That's what he says. Ah! Oh, Blue's got a vendetta against my shop. I'm going to build it closer to here. He knows how powerful that mana will be for my uh, Shadow Hunter. Berserk for the win. Can be. I was using it a bit earlier and it wasn't doing too well versus the cigarettes when they were attacking my uh, Berserkers. Let's probably get some demolishers now. Make it a bit easier to go through bases. Interrupt some of this healing and mana. The shop is almost up. No Age of Empires today. Oh, I didn't actually, no. Didn't have as much time as I normally do. Hey, Torrent Chieftain's in town. Torrent Chieftain's coming to town. I think that's more or less cleared up. I'm trying to steal all my goodness from the shop. Let's move on to the next base. Time is ticking, boys and girls. I need to clean up shop. I think we should go visit Pier with just a couple of shaman and see if he pays attention. You could just put it on one shaman and stand in the middle, but I think it's more funny just to do this. I'll come back to that. I need to see it. Seeing is believing. It's like pitting them against one another. Ah, my Torrent Chieftain! So, Serpent Wards don't seem to benefit from Endurance Aura, because I'm definitely standing close enough for them to do so. So that's a deliberate move, I think, from Blizzard, to make sure that Serpent Wards don't get any extra buffs. Bit of a shame, though. Gotta say. I put lightning shield all over him. Ugh. 
This is a bit much now. <laughs> what the heck is going on? There we go. I've still got a grunt in base. When did that happen? Yeah, no, these serpent fort wards will actually be very good anti air if the enemy aren't paying proper attention. Yay! Victory! Level 2 Endurance Aura. So 50 damage basically on average. It's a lot. It's a lot. There's not really any units that have that much damage. I think fully upgraded Wyvern might be closer to that. Or maybe a little bit more. But you're talking about a 4 food unit. Don't know why this guy is staying in the game. He was a troll. All right, well, I've got to go, so I've got to call things now. So I will... Uh, <laughs> I will... Uh, all right, I'll see you guys later. Take care. Hey, Witty here. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to my channel for Warcraft free content every day. Just click the bell icon next to the subscribe button to be notified of the latest Warcraft free news. You can check out even more at wittywarcraft.com to stay in the loop. There's blogs, topics on interacting with me and others at my Twitch, forums and more. Don't forget to follow me at wittywarcraft on Twitter to get all the latest. And come watch me live almost every day at twitch.tv slash witty. If you'd like to go that extra mile and support this channel and everything I do, then you are welcome to join me and become a Patreon at patreon.com slash wittywarcraft. Thank you so much and take care. Bye bye.